God is saying to you today, the place where my holy will and the crown you so rightly deserve await, rewarded for your endurance, your resilience against the enemy, and your unwavering love and belief in me. Through every trial, you are mine, you belong to me, and your value is immeasurable. In this world you may never fully grasp the depth of my tender longing for you, to hold your hands, to touch your weary eyes, to ease the burdens of your restless nights, but know this, I will strengthen you mightily and bless you so abundantly that all who know you will marvel at your transformation. You will tell others it was neither luck nor your own strength that brought you success. You will testify that it was I who blessed you supernaturally. Do not resist me. Surrender your soul to me fully. Let my words echo in your mind, decorating the halls of your memory with the treasured moments we have shared. I desire for you to recall and cherish our journey together, the times I delivered you from evil, the instances of miraculous rescue. Today, as you walk your path, remember that love, healing, comfort, and blessings flow abundantly in my presence. Move forward with confidence, enveloped in my peace and affection. I love you deeply and I await your return each day. Rise each morning with enthusiasm and faith, for this brings me great joy. Stand firm against life's challenges. You were not made to shrink away. You mirror my image, filled with a burning desire to do good, to assist and serve, to maintain unity and harmony within your family and to welcome my blessings with each new dawn. Continue in this way, unwavering in your faith. Your very existence is an act of worship, a song of praise. You are a beacon of goodness, and through your actions you glorify me. I seek to open doors for you that others might see in you a true and devoted faith, a genuine love for me. I hold you in high regard, admiring your resilience against the harsh winds of adversity, your refusal to meet betrayal with bitterness. From those who claimed friendship yet brought hurt, they may have taken material things, but they could not take what is essential, your faith, your dedication, your resolute commitment to follow my will, come what may. Type 11. 11 to claim it. Today's God message for me. You are undoubtedly my child, and the word I planted in you has flourished abundantly. There are still many blessings and gifts for you to reap. Be assured of a bright future and my unwavering support in every circumstance. Approach my altar with confidence. Pour out your soul to me in any need. Should doubts arise, even if you stumble, I remain faithful. I will never forsake you. My presence will envelop you wherever you are and you will feel me. Your skin will sense my closeness. Your soul will be reassured of my protective embrace, ready with legions eager to assist you. They will grant you victory over those who oppose you, bring healing to your ailments, and empower your words to cast down forces of darkness. Your life, your family, your health, and your finances. Everyone within your home will experience freedom and victory. Your dwelling will be suffused with my majestic glory, and daily you will witness supernatural miracles. You will be surrounded by virtuous people, and through the generous spirit you possess, many will be blessed. I urge you once more, remain steadfast in your true self. 
Do not retreat to the shadows of disbelief. Seek me, pray to me, immerse yourself in learning, and continue to grow. Be filled with my Holy Spirit, who daily manifests my affection and love for you. Embrace the peace I provide that fortifies you. I am ever speaking to your valiant heart, and today my message is clear. Do not surrender. Do not falter. Do not lose hope. Reject the encroachments of doubt and fear. Know this. I am your protector, your shield, your strength. I am your friend, your father, your God. Hear me again. I am your God. Blessings are coming, reserved for those who show courage. Today marks the day of your liberation. You have endured seasons of sorrow and felt your strength wane. Yet even in such trials your bravery has shone brightly. You are indeed my child, chosen from your mother's womb to live a life of prosperity and blessing. Yet the enemy has sought to ensnare you with deceit, aiming to crush your spirit through his minions of darkness. Your innocent heart may have once succumbed to fear, but within you burns an unquenchable flame its origin divine. When despair seemed to claim you, my voice pierced the darkness. I sought you, rescued you, and you beheld my glory, witnessing the miracles I have planned for you. Now, as you face these current trials, rise up, stand firm, Show your adversaries that my greatness resides in your humility and simplicity. Engage fiercely in prayer. Live in my power. The blessings you seek will be granted according to my will. I will answer. I will provide for your needs. I am preparing you for greater things on the horizon in the days ahead. Focus on seeking and listening to me. I am about to unveil your destiny and transform your life. Wait for me with anticipation. My love for you is profound and simple. Trust in me with the innocence and faith of a child. I alone fully understand and see the challenges you face. Though you feel lost, unable to discern the way forward, from my vantage point I assure you there is a path. A way out is near. Let me lead you. Heed my word. Fill your heart with divine wisdom, and I will speak to you daily. My promises are the key to liberate you from your despair. All you need to do is kneel and pray. Afterward, rise and act on those ideas, those dreams, those plans you hold dear. Everything necessary to fulfill your noble desires rests in my hands. I am the keeper of all riches, the master of all resources. I will provide what you need, proving that I have always been, am now, and will forever be the shepherd of your soul. You will want for nothing. Speak and I will fill your words with wisdom and blessings. You have called for my help, and I am here to answer. I will illuminate the path you must follow, manage the details that are beyond your grasp. Whenever you encounter something baffling, call out to me and trust me with your anxieties. Maintain a light heart and a clear mind, and continue to do what you can. Leave to me that which you cannot do. Walk in this assurance, my child. My presence is your constant companion, your ceaseless aid. Focus your efforts on what truly matters. Pray for your family, yes, but also actively fight for them. They face their own struggles, and through you, they can learn more about me and find the courage to believe and trust. 
I have abundant blessings waiting for them, and I can transform their lives. I desire unity and peace within your family at all times. Pray and fast, for it is necessary, but also engage with them. Talk, listen, and be present. Show them the same attention I give to you. Through your actions, let them come to know me as their God. I love you deeply, and I am committed to standing by you as you face these challenges. Together we are invincible. No force, be it sadness, depression, despair, or turmoil, can defeat us. Rest your head on my shoulder. It's okay to shut out the hurtful whispers of loneliness that haunt you at night, convincing you of untruths about your life. Don't listen to them. Feel the tenderness of my embrace right now. The pain you're experiencing isn't the end of your story, nor does it define your worth. Hand over your suffering to me and find rest. If you need to cry, let the tears come. I am here to cry with you, right by your side. Together tonight, we will face the darkness. And when tomorrow's sun rises bright with the light of faith, you will still feel the warmth of your Heavenly Father next to you. Know that in the deepest night, even if loneliness seeks to overwhelm you, I will never leave. I remain here to comfort and strengthen you to affirm your immense value to me. Type Amen if you trust in God. God says, Who then can separate you from my love? Hear it directly from me and engrave it deep within your heart. No anguish, persecution, doubt, or tribulation can ever pull you away from my steadfast, immense, and true love. Remember this always, despite any failings or mistakes you might perceive in yourself. My love for you remains unchanging. I do not fail, I do not lie, I do not exaggerate. If I have declared my love for you a million times, know that my love never wavers. We have spoken many times. You've heard my assurances of love. Now it is time for you to take my affection seriously and cast aside your doubts. Let your faith be strong, not like a sailboat tossed by the waves, but steady. You will not be overwhelmed. You will not perish. You will not falter. Believe this. Embrace it. It is time to rise, to walk forward with faith and certainty. You have already received much from my hand, and I promise you countless blessings still await. Entrust your heart to me and never cease to trust. I assure you, I will never ever abandon you. Tell me you believe this. Feel my presence. I am right here with you. Speak to me and let us share our thoughts. I will compensate you for all those nights you cried yourself to sleep, for the deep hurts you endured yet continued to trust, for your silent tears. The pain that has long burdened your soul will be lifted. I will envelop you in my immense love. As this year progresses, continually seek to discover more about me and the depths of my love for you. Explore different forms of prayer and worship. Experiment with new spiritual disciplines and immerse yourself in the study of my word. Each of these practices will enrich your faith and provide new insights into my character and will for your life. To support our channel, Please subscribe our channel and turn on bell notification.